We'll do a YouTube video, Papa. So we're camping here at Montauk Campgrounds Outer Beach. And it is soft sand, even though there's rocks in it. And people kind of think because there's rocks in it, they may not have to lower down so much. But a guy got stuck right on the main road coming in. I'm actually going to back up to him and, and yank him out if he can't get out. So uh, let's see how he's doing. Uh, you know what? I can make a Yui in there. Let's go follow him to the main road. Let's see how the guy's doing. Why you can like this? I can hopefully spin it around. But he was stuck there with his camper. I saw him, he sunk, I stopped him immediately. I said, lower down more. And he's got pretty aggressive tires. How do you? I could pull him backwards. Hard? I can pull him backwards or pull him forward. I'll turn around. You gonna give it a shot? I have 15 in, but- I, What I, about I, the camper? I, I didn't lower the camper. Gotta, we gotta lower the camper. Got to lower the camper, so we're going to lower his camper tires quick. I'm going to help him out with that. All right, I'll spin around and I'll put my airheads on there. Oh, I'll get the other side. Yeah, I got the airhead, uh, the air downs. So let me spin this around. You guys are going to get a long video out of this thing. <laughs> I know. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to stick the Ford in the dashboard. <laughs> and let's see. But, but believe it or not, now the proof is in the pudding. Now this guy got stuck. I mean, if if I if I didn't come up the road in time and see him and say, hey, hey, stop, stop, because he was sinking down. He actually made the tongue of his trailer hit the dirt. So uh, that's well, the tongue, the jack, I should say. So that's pretty bad. So he would have, you know, he would have been. Once that happens, if your tires are slipping and you keep going, you're just going to drop right to the ground. I mean, that that's it. So once you feel the slip, then figure out what you're going to do to get yourself out. Don't keep trying to get out. It's obviously, if it stopped you from moving and you slipped down and started sinking, you're not going any further. So stop, air down, try it a little bit. If that doesn't work, then do something else. Dig yourself out, whatever you got to do, but don't just dig a hole. I'm going to get the air downs and air him down. I'll let you guys watch the video. I'm going to leave this on the thing while we air him down. I'll put this over here. So you can watch the, I'll go with the trailheads, Papa. Let me get them. Mm -hmm. The trailheads and air them down. You can come out too.
All right, let's see how he's doing. All right, go ahead. Let's see if you can move out. Let's see how he does. I don't want him to know I'm recording. <laughs> I feel bad. I'm making. Let's see if he digs out or moves. No, no. Forget it. He's. Yo, he got him out. He got him out. There you go. From being dead stuck. You see the difference? The proof was in the pudding. Now, he started spinning. I was getting nervous. But, see, by lowering his camper tires, too, the, even more. Hold on, Papa. So, we got the guy rolling again. Okay. So, that's a lesson to you guys going on the beach. That when you think you don't have to air down or you don't have to air down your camper tires. So if you got soft sand, you better be safe and bring it down to 15 pounds at least. Don't even play games with it. And when you do that, you also don't want to jackknife your trailer backwards. Because if you turn it sharp, you can pop your tire right off the beat. And that's going to be a real pain in the ass too. So you don't need that happening. So when you back up, back up easy. Remember your tires are going to look like pancakes, right? So... And that's that. So, we did our good deed for the day. The guy's rolling, he's on his way. Now we're going back to our site. Hopefully I'll be able to, there's not much service here, so. This was actually, what day number is today? The 18th, 618, Friday. Friday the 18th of June, 2021. And we're gonna um, probably post this thing tomorrow when I get home, because there's no service here. Hope you guys enjoyed this nine minute ridiculous video. <laughs>